point. Let's move on yeah, to something just... a little different here. Uh, I, I'm personally a little excited here. I was just uh, shot word here that uh, apparently we got correspondence from a loyal listener. That's right. Somebody shot us an email just now, and, and I'm excited because we've never gotten any type of correspondence or a phone call or smoke signals or nothing, you know? So I, I say let's read it right here right now. Should we? Should we do that? All right, let's do it. Can we get that? All right. It's, here it is right here. All right. <clears throat> Dear Gordo, your show sucks. Signed, Oscar. <laughs> oh, yeah, Oscar. <laughs> hey, thanks for writing in, bro. I appreciate it. Uh, you know, I've just been noticing something. I could tell by the way you wrote and all this that you may have woken up a little grouchy. <laughs> See what I did there? The, gr the grouchy. <laughs> well, it's good to know that we have at least one listener. Hey, speaking of bad breath, is your dog afraid to stand in front of you when you talk? When you go give a speech, do you clear out the auditorium? Does water trickle down your chin because it doesn't want to stay in your mouth any longer? Well, it could be because of your stinky breath, bro. Goodness sakes, that's gross. Hey, I tell you what, you need to check out Dr. Mooney's Breath Revitalizer. Here's Glenn Thirsty to tell you a little bit more about that. I would like to talk to you about something serious. No, no you're making me laugh. Stop. I want to talk seriously now about a very bad problem. It's called... Hematosis. Hamatosis. <coughs> Hasmatosis is a big scientific word, believe it or not, for bad breasts. And we must. Oh! God, the counter! Oh. <sighs> we must take a stand today over. Or the scourge of hematosis. Dr. Booney's breast revitalizer can fix this problem. It will make your social contact much more social. No more people will avoid you because of your bad breasts. Folks will even enjoy the smell. <laughs> Start a be a life of the party, just like old Glenn. Well, take Dr. Rooney's breasts, rev rev revisitors, and 